Welcome to Nate's Vintage Trains. We're at Orange County Model Engineers for their 2023 fall meet. Welcome to Orange County Model Engineers 2023 fall meet. As with my other meet videos, we're going to take a good look around, ride on some trains, and just have a lot of grand old fun with some friends of mine that you may have seen before in my other videos. So without any further ado, let's dive right into it. It's a long drive from where I live to get down here, but it was worth it, let me tell you. But by the time I got here, people were already starting to run their trains, including an interesting steam outline. Anyway, so I had brought my train down, which I'll explain more in another video. And people were slowly starting to arrive and unload their equipment for having fun the whole day. Some people from SCLS brought their stuff as well which you shall see a little later too. I took my locomotive out for a good long run. They have 12,000 feet of track here. I think it's over two miles. But my locomotive could handle the track as well as the gradients, no problems multiple times over. I haven't really put it to the test yet. One drawback of my engine it is that it's old and I think the gears need some help is why it makes so much noise. Soon enough, the real live steam locomotives were coming out. Sorry, Willie. Tank engines, small little moguls, and an 060, which my friend was firing up. There was also a very vintage and antique style locomotive being run around by another visitor. We hopped on my friend's locomotive and headed out onto the main line for just running around and talking to people on the train. One of the best parts of the railroad has to be the over and under with the bridge feature. Say hi to your friends. I love the Pacific Electric car. <laughs> After lunch, the main yard got pretty full with trains since there was a scheduled photo shoot for the club to take pictures of engines to promote their meet as well as any visitors to take pictures of all the different variety of equipment there was to offer. Not saying that any of this stuff was for sale because I doubt any of it was for sale. After a few photos and videos were taken, people started running their trains out of the yard back onto the line just to have some more fun running their trains. 
One by one, they paraded out of the yard, and boy, it was a sight to see the different types of motive power. And I had to just get some fun on my locomotive. My cars weren't handy at the time. Oh, that's nice. Of course, with any parade or cavalcade for that matter, there's bound to be a traffic jam at some point. I went back round and grabbed my flat cars so I'd have a more comfortable ride. And then we were off just running around the track and playing trains. But there were a few traffic jams, I might say. I was able to hop a ride on a beautiful C21 Rio Grande narrow gauge locomotive, the Baby Mud Hats. <sighs> this was a beautiful engine and a friend of mine was running it. I have a lot of friends down here so I'm not just talking about one person.
back again on the little blue 060 steam locomotive. I like to call it Boy Blue, but the owner has a different idea for the name. I was offered to operate one of the SCLS members' locomotives, which he was very kind to offer so, and of course I took him up on that offer. But as evening kept going into later and almost night time, it was time for dinner and afterwards some night running. It's notoriously difficult to get good shots at night, so I didn't take many. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you do like this sort of content, please subscribe. Next week I will be visiting Los Angeles Live Steamers at their 2023 fall meet and bringing my locomotive as well. Stay tuned for updates on my train and some more videos from Orange County Model Engineers too. So with that, thank you so much for watching. Keep it old school, Jesus loves you, and God bless you all.